Good afternoon, dear students. Today we will learn a new topic: estimation. The word estimation means approximation. That means you have to approximate the things. Suppose there is a quantity like ninety nine. So we can say it nearly hundred. That is approximation. We approximated ninety nine to hundred, and that is known as estimation. Today we will learn rounding of number or estimating number to nearest tens, hundreds, thousand. And there is a one general rule to do the estimation. Let's see it. Suppose I take a number six, seven, eight, nine. Four, and I have to approximate it to nearest ten, nearest hundred, and nearest thousand. Now, how to solve this problem? I will give you very general method to solve this problem. See the fingers of your hands. One, two, three, four. There are four fingers. One, two, three, four, and starting from this thumb, and take the fingers over here. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. These are the magical digits in rounding of the numbers, or you can say in the estimation. Now let me tell you how these digits help you in estimation. The number is six seven eight nine four. You have to round off six seven eight nine four to nearest tens. See, this is the ones place and this is the tens place. You have to round off this digit, but you have to check ones digit. You have to round off nearest tens. That means you have to round off tens digit, but You will check ones digit. Now here, ones digit is in the group one. Name this group as group one and group two. Whenever a digit is there in group one, then the digit will change to zero, and there won't be any change in the number. I repeat. Whenever the digit to be checked is in group one, then it will become zero, and there won't be any change in the number. So rounding off sixty-seven thousand eight hundred ninety-four to nearest tens, we get sixty-seven thousand eight hundred ninety. Now I will round off this number to nearest hundred. Now, which place you have to round off? That is nearest hundred. For this, you will check tens digit. For this, you will check tens digit because when we check for nearest ten, we check ones digit. Now we have to round off to nearest hundred. So we will check nearest tens digit. That means one digit to the right. Of the number to be rounded off. Now nine, nine is in group two. Whenever we get the digit of group two, then we make that digit as zero and all the digits besides it as zero. So four will become zero, nine will become zero. Now you will say that ma'am, what is the change in both the rounding off? There is one change. Whenever the number belongs to group two. You will add one to the hundred digit or the digit to be rounded off. You will add one to the place which is to be rounded off. So it will become six, seven, nine. So our answer will be sixty-seven thousand nine hundred. It is clear to you. Whenever our number is from group two, we will 
change the digit to 0 and all other digits also beside it as 0 and add 1 to the digit which is to be rounded off. Now to nearest thousand. This number I have to round off to nearest thousand. Which is the thousand place? Once, tens, hundred, thousand. That means we have to round off seven. But we have to check hundred place. We have to check hundred place. So hundred place is eight. It belongs to group two. So all the digits besides eight and that digit will become zero. And one will be added to the digit which is to be rounded off. So it will become 8. So our answer will be 68,000. So it is clear that whenever we round off the numbers, we have to check which place we have to round off. And after that, the next place to it, towards right. We will check whether the digit belongs to group 1, 1, 2, 3, 4 or group 2, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Group 2, if it belongs to group 1, we have to do nothing, just change that digit to 0 or all the digit besides it if it is 100 place or 1000 place. But if our digit belongs to group 2, we will make that digit as 0 and all other digits beside it as 0 and add 1 to the digit which is to be rounded off. I hope it is clear to you.